All right, let's go ahead and do this thing. Get this working. Had to scrap an episode. That was that was unfortunate though. It was uh It was a win. And I'm going to tell you guys right now, it was with Angels, Ajals, even though I said that I would never let that happen again, that I would never disgrace the name of Magic the Gathering with that Angel deck again. I had an idea to make it better, and it worked. The deck wins now, like, consistently. Um, but it's a, me and the opponent got off to on the wrong foot, and uh, he turned out to be a, a really good guy, and then the whole channel thing, I think, maybe... Uh, because it's intimidating for me, for fuck's sake. So I'm sure people who just kind of stumble... I always feel kind of weird about it because these are people that don't necessarily know um, that I'm I'm watching them, but in, like, a sexy way. Um, but uh, well, yeah, that's not what I meant to say. Um, let's fiend. Because this would be nice, but we can't do that just yet. Fiend's going to punch exactly the same as this item. I'm not really sure. It's got evasion, though. So, it's flying around up there. Really cool art. So, we just scrapped that episode, which is fine. It's not going to hurt anybody. We'll just do some artifact goodness, which I don't think we've done artifacts. We did the black green. Yesterday was supposed to be artifacts, but it ended up being the garbage. Um, so, that happened. I could smash for three right here, but I could just play this and get another guy. I could just play this and not do any of that. Yeah. Let's just sit for a minute. This guy's got a few too many cards, so we'll have to see what happens here. Um, no tax, the only one. It's not going to block either, though, so it's just going to sit there. You know, after a couple turns, we might be able to get Juggernaut down. So we put in Reprisal because we had no removal, and then I figured since we had white in here, we have access to kind of the best removal in the game, which is strange. Um, that sucks balls. Which is strange to say, but entirely accurate because... You have the Exile spells, you have Angelic Edict, and you have Reprisal, both of which are really amazing. Angelic Edict more so than anything, simply because it, you know, removes dudes from play, and they can't be interacted with at all anymore, which which really is nice to have there. I'm really bummed about this, this O1. The only upside is that I can bounce him back to my hand, maybe, uh, but this guy very intelligently... Locked that down, and so now I don't have that option because he would have been getting hit for four right there. We would have been getting started. Would have been 16, 19, much better for me. Uh, I would attack here if I was him. I won't block it. I'll take the 18. There's really no reason not to. I can't. I mean, it would be insane for me to kill this guy. I would lose my Mirror Smith. Um, if I chump it, I lose the token. That's absolutely the right move. And if I uh, block with the Sculptor, that, that's incorrect. If I block with the Sculptor, he could have pump, so I wouldn't do that because I wouldn't want to throw Sculptor away. See, after this turn, I'm going to get um, Master out there, and that's going to be a bit more of a sticky wicket for this gentleman, which is unfortunate because he really did have some potential there to do some stuff. I could also do Juggernaut, though. And then mastered make Juggernaut a 6-6 six, six on its attacking turn. Um, so let's go ahead and do this. Let's go make a bonus guy. We got kind of be a little wary though, because this cat's at five mana. I've been playing a lot of uh, Tales of Graces. Tales of Hearts are. I've been playing a lot of that. The uh, localization. Did some stuff to Gaul. Oh, not a fan. I thought I was just thinking that he might have, um, might have, uh, gotta go because he was getting spanked. No, <laughs> um, you might have something. Fuck it. Uh, the board wipe thing, you know, wipey McBordleton. You guys know about board wipe thing. You guys all know about this. If you, uh, so what's the deal with the board wipe thing? Am I right? You've heard about this. You guys know about this. <laughs> That's my Jerry Seinfeld impersonation. Super topical. I know everybody be thinking about Jerry Seinfeld nowadays. You know, we in 2015, you got rep that Seinfeld. Actually, I heard that Huru is trying to get weird block. Uh, fucking crazy block. Uh, Hulu is trying to get up in that Jerry Seinfeld business. You know that the computer doesn't have that board wiper, though, because it would block the 6-6 six, six, all dizzy. 
Um, I'm pretty sure I won. What the hell was going on with this deck? Weird things. Strange things are happening to me. Uh, yeah, Tricolor Land doesn't really matter. Pop that down there. Capucho! Uh, you could have... I don't take any damage this turn for three mana. Safe Passage. Divine Verdict. 7-7's seven, dead. Oh, fuck. That really sucked. Hey, my dude wakes up. Wow, that was terrible. That was really bad for me. <laughs> it sucked balls. Oh, goodness. That was that was bad. Should not have attacked with the Sevenses. I, I didn't see the Divine Verdict, though. I only saw... I only saw what I wanted to see, you guys. And look what it cost me dearly, actually. I might get fucked here. Oh, yeah, that's not great. I've only got two reprisals in hand. What did reprisal used to be? It used to be a creature, I think. I don't remember what it took out for reprisal, actually. Oh, that's pretty good. Actually, no, because I still don't get to do anything, but whatever, it's fine. Sphinx, suck it! Man, block down that skull. Man, I got spanked right there. Oh, goodness, computer. Goodness. All right, I get to attack with three artifacts. I at least get one more, but that'll be in the air. See, each one of these guys that I get to swap out for being one guy in the air is okay with me. Because I'll block two, but for two guys, I get one in the air with evasion that he can't do anything to. So that's kind of nice. Um... What did I take out of here to get the surprisal in here? Hey, now. Pull that back. Uh, and I actually get through with the Sphinx as well. I wasn't thinking about attacking with the Sphinx, but I might as well. See what happens. Get two dudes. Removal spell. Fuck me, I knew it. I knew it. That's why I wasn't thinking about uh, attacking with him. Oh, when will you learn your lesson? When will you learn it? You never will, because you're dumb. You are a stupid man. And you should not be allowed to play this game. The rumors are true. Oh, is this just like what even is this deck though? I'm so confused. I'm so scared. I'm so alone. Uh, I might kill my five five. If I drew the guy who gets guys out of the yard, I'd be pretty happy. He's not big enough, but it'd be cool if I could kill him and then. Do some stuff. I might have taken the guy who bounces dudes back to my hand out of this, actually. Be cool if you play one more dude so I can murder this 3-3. Be kind of nice, because otherwise I'm going to be in trouble. Oh, super. Super, super, super. Take this. 13. Excellent. Nope, didn't take it out. All day. Yippee. I've never been happier in my life. Alrighty then. We got this going. We got this going now. Hit the deck. What did I take out for reprisal? Does anyone know? Um, it's amazing because I like still don't get to attack or do anything. Bad even has evasion, so look at me go. Take a look at me now. Except the 4-3 is not attacking anymore. I'm just not even going to do it. It's not even going to happen. Hey, get to kill that 4-4 now. Ooh, you're hubris, planeswalker. You're hubris. Yo, fuck you. Deed. You're deed, my friend. No blocks. Take the three. Don't give a shit. It's fine. Everything's fine. Don't care. Don't care. It's okay. Bounce this Glaze Fiend to my hand, though. Because it's got evasion. The 5-5 five five is pretty good, too. But Bounce that Fiend. Yep. Oh, shucks, you guys. Shucky Shucklesteins. This is getting crazy. Um... Glaze Fiend. Make a dude. Yes. Oh, here it is. Here she is right here. Jugs. Big old Juggle Jugs. Yep. Sure. Do it. Okay. Here we go. Still don't care about that board wipe, even though I obviously should. Uh, I still... Do I get to attack yet? And this guy kind of done his job. Yeah, just everybody fuck it. Oh, uh, we'll pull that. Oh, no, 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 no. We'll take that guy. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Blocks, blocks, four, five. Yeah, I might as well just do this. I don't know why I attacked with the guys on the ground. <laughs> 
Uh, it doesn't matter because the five. I still I had the five five out and I got Glaze Fiend. Okay, it's fun. Except Glaze Fiend does nothing now because I don't get to bounce the other five five, which was part of that plan. I decked anyway. Why the fuck? Computer, what is happening over there? Jesus Christ. Okay. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's okay. We're all right. We're all all right. I'm gonna block that. I don't even. One card in hand. What are the chances, you guys? What are the chances? Im impossible, isn't it? No, there's four of those in there. Yeah, that would have been hilarious. Oh my God, that would have been so funny. That was a weird attack, computer. That was a weird attack. I don't really get it. I don't really understand what was happening there. That guy's gotta go. He's gotta go. He's got a date. A hot date today with your face. What the fuck? Oh, two dudes. Okay, this thing gonna end well. What, like, what is even happening here? Oh, chumples. Chump chumply. That's what's happening there. Untap yourself, son. Wake back up. Wow, this is uh, starting to take forever here against the computer. There's a couple really bad plays for me, though, just because I, I don't know. It's the computer. Who cares? I guess I should start taking the computer more seriously because I'm starting to do some bad plays against real opponents, too. So, Well, Christ. Yep, get on over there, bud. You can do it. Blocks, they're both dead. Block, block. I mean, it's just not really favorable. I can just sit here and keep murdering these tokens, I guess. Zero cards in hand's not bad. That guy wakes up again. I shouldn't have attacked with Esperzoa. I'm going to stand up. I'm so upset with myself. Now I'll just sit back down think about what I've done. It's like playing poker. It's like we're on the WPT cam. Check that out. Ah, uh, it's a 3-3. I can't murder. Wow, 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 wow. Yes! Yes! Glaze Fiend. Boom. Bow. Yep. Don't care. Boom. Glaze Fiend. It's a 2-3. That's what's up. Pow. Glaze Fiend. 4-5. That's what's happening. That's what I'm... I'm all about that. Okay. Block there. So I can do five, take him to two. Everybody else dies though. What's the point of that? It's crazy talk. He has to kill one of his guys to this five, five. What the hell? That's not cool. But see, now I can just overwhelm him next turn by attacking with everyone, so that's fine. So we're kind of okay. Take a bit of magic here. The gathering to get me out of this one. No, that's fine. All right, well. Whatever. Hey, there's that guy. If it decided to show up to the party. Everybody, I don't even care. Oh, one, two. Who gives a shit? Get over there, bud. Flap on over there and just kind of just hang out. You just fly over and you just sit down. And you're just like, what's happening? What are you going to do today? Alright, that was a thing that happened. I don't know. Let's get another one. Okay. <laughs> Let's try and get another one in here. Oh, man. This is... This isn't the worst. I don't know. We'll see what we can do. We might be able to work something out here. Did I go first or does he go first? He goes first. That's unfortunate for me. I really wish I had... Uh had gone first there but red's not good that means a little bit of burn might be coming my way and that's not really great when you've got a sculptor or strix out there at least there's no red that lets him divide the damage up i kill both of them with one spell because that kind of two for one is not really uh something i look forward to have happen to me can i do this this way yes i can because everything will be cheaper Play this guy first, then play this, because that's actually going to make everything cheaper so that I can play the uh, slow land and still be kind of okay, because I can Strix on that third turn, so everything's fine. Uh, this guy obviously doesn't affect Strix at all because he doesn't have a colorless mana symbol. Um, that's something early people, um, newcomers to the game, might be a little surprised by it. It doesn't just reduce the cost, though. It uh, only reduces it by that specific cost, so it wouldn't reduce color cost out of the cmc i'm trying to think what i should do here i feel like i can get this too 
but I'll get the same two whether or not I mean he's gonna burn this either way I'm just gonna go ahead and drop this and see what happens uh, that was a first main, second main kind of thing that we were talking about. I, I, I wasn't expecting that at all. I thought blue was kind of a tertiary thing for him. Might just be in there for the card draw, though. Um, I'm not sure what this deck is yet. It could be five colors, so that would be interesting. You'd think that we'd see more counters, um, but he could just have board wiping removal spells as well. The three damage would do the trick and settle that score quite lovely for him. Um, we're doing all right, though. I'm not too scared about what's happening here. We can play Master and get an extra guy out this turn, which actually be pretty nice. Master gets wiped out by that board wipe just as sure as anybody else does, though, uh, which is a thing that we need to be mindful of. He only costs two, and I get an extra guy. I get to hit him for more damage. Let's go ahead and do that. I'm a little worried that this guy's going to lock down my side of the field. Now, we might hold off on some of this other stuff. I'm probably going to play Biden uh, next turn because I'll also get an extra guy out of that as well. Um, but other than that, we're probably going to sit tight because I am getting a little worried about what he has removal-wise. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. We do have 12 damage on the field, though. Board wipe right now would be appropriate, but does not seem to be happening if he doesn't have anything. And there's the board wipe. Uh, they all get exiled as well, which is a real bummer. Um, so I can't utilize my gargoyle. But that's obviously something that we were talking about. That's something that was possible this whole time. So we'll just put this down. We will put Strix down. We will save gargoyle for as long as possible. Hopefully we get to put Biden down next turn and kind of get that out of the way he only has one more anger of the gods until such a time as he reshuffles his pile i assume that he has the ability to get stuff out of the yard or to interact with the yard in some fashion see now that's really rough for us because biden doesn't do much for us there and it's a first striker which is also kind of rough This is not good. I could have played Glaze Fiend this turn and then Biden next turn, especially since I'm not attacking, but I don't foresee myself attacking. I see Glaze Fiend eating this 5-5. Five, five. Except that I can't actually... Let's just do this. And then we'll Gargoyle into Strix. And then be able to attack at least a little bit. Draw some cards, hopefully. Generate a little bit of value here. That's a problem. So I still can't really attack. Does he have the two blue open? I didn't think that was the blue one. Am I wrong? That's Necropolis. It is the blue. Well, fuck me. I'm going to bash with both these guys, though. Because I don't really have a choice. I need to draw some cards. I need to draw at least one. We're going to see what he has a premium on. Probably the 2-3. Uh, we're just going to see what he'd rather kill. Yep, that makes sense. Strix will come down and hopefully murder. I mean, the 5-5 five five can't come at me as long as Strix is out. So, that's a thing. We do have the removal in here. I mean, we could get rid of these 5-5s. Five now, I'm going to block this guy all day. He, he doesn't seem to have... I mean, he hasn't killed it, obviously, so... Okay. Uh, but he could have just given it... No, because then I just would have blocked it with the opposite color. Uh, so that's absolutely right. Sorry about that. I forgot that Gargoyle was white for a minute there. Uh, thinking that he could give it protection so that it's unblockable, but I just would have blocked it with the other color. So There's a problem with tricolor decks like this they can get around stuff like that kind of easily 
Um, I mean, I really need to draw some more cards here. Hopefully he doesn't have something else. Think twice from the yard. I'm just going to sit here and try and draw something. Land is not going to do it. Juggernaut's not the worst thing that could have happened, but it's not good. Because Sculptor only costs one. But he still gets to wipe my side of the field out if he has the other burn spell. Which is a problem. So I almost feel like holding on to Sculptor, but there's really no point. I might as well just drop everything I can so I can draw more cards next turn. Otherwise, I'm in a lot of trouble. I mean, if I had the uh, reprisal, I'd be in business. But as it stands right now, I'm in a lot of trouble. If he board wipes, I'm completely fucked. Artifacts, artifacts. The five five is the only one coming in. I go to ten. I mean, he can also just wipe the world. I mean, he has other board wipes as well, but they're they kind of work out for me too. Because I finally got rid of those two creatures. I don't have any card draw anymore, though, which is a problem. I mean, I do have the artifact that I could find somehow, and, and hopefully that would go off for me, but there's no guarantee that that would happen. We finally got Reprisal, which is really a goddamn shame, considering my situation now. Um, this guy... Yeah, I get to Reprise that, but he gets to draw four cards, which is a real problem for us. I'm just going to do that right now. Fuck me. Wow. That's really good. That'll do it. I, I mean, unless I draw another reprisal right off the top. Or the death touch guy. But even then, I'm going to lose four mana. It's really hard to think of a way out of this. Really tough to try and work my way out of this one. Trying to get him right with that immediate reprisal. Try and get something to work out there. Um, we want just regular lands. I mean, this is just really messed up. If I can draw the third. Oh, wait, no, I'm sorry. I just, I wasn't even thinking about how much damage I'd already taken. It's really unfortunate. I mean,. Good deck though. That's a that was a fun deck. Five color. Five colors, kind of always been relevant. You don't see it played a lot because a lot of people fall into some different traps with it, with having like too many counters or too many creatures and stuff like that. Um, I mean, we obviously had problems with that when we were building it ourselves. So, uh, five colors playable. I mean, it makes sense. It's a thing that you can do. That's artifacts. I mean, I'm gonna keep working on it. It's just kind of disappointing, a little boring to be honest with you. Um, it's like a weird, slower token gen deck. I mean, there are faster ways to generate tokens. I almost feel like it wants to be a supporting card type, but it can't really. Uh, like it wants stuff like Mentor of the Meek in there, which is nice, but Mentor of the Meek doesn't really trigger anything. Neither does the Artificer, but... You know, it's just a strange kind of setup. I don't really like Biden too much. I put it in here because it's an artifact. You know, it holds value as far as that's concerned. Juggernaut's not the most reliable guy either, but it's like, especially when you don't have Blasting Station or whatever it's called. Um, I don't know. I mean, it, Artifacts are just not as much fun as it was in some of the earlier iterations of the game. It's an interesting concept, but it just kind of feels 
half-hearted almost like like the artifacts don't want to show up and we didn't get some of the best artifacts that would make the interactions a lot of fun you know what i mean like we didn't get you know i, I talk about sad android a lot but we didn't get him um and that really i think just that card alone really would have turned me around on artifacts and i don't think it would have been overpowered per se considering what else we have uh, it could have been cast for zero which would be awesome but at least it would have some abuse with it there you know what i mean at least a little bit of abuse that we could kind of do something with but as it stands right now they're just i mean you've got thopters but that's super slow i mean there are other decks that rush down way faster than that one you have to play it you kind of have to play artifacts aggressive but it's like a slow mid-ranged aggressiveness that's just not quite good enough um they didn't really give us any big artifacts to to sack out dudes and do crazy stuff with they didn't give us um sheep factory or whatever so <sighs> goat tokens i mean it's a uh, kind of a disappointing prospect but still still fun i mean it's still something that i'm gonna mess around with see what i can do i really appreciate you guys checking out this video thank you so much i will see you all next time